Rome Reborn 2.0 features a number of improvements to the model. The first includes procedurally modeled Class 2 content, made possible by procedural incorporated City Engine software. All 7,000 Class 2 buildings were remodeled procedurally to contain windows, doors, and other details. These were integrated in with the Class 1 hand modeled buildings and a new lighting solution using an HDR image of the sky of Rome and distributed securely over the internet using a remote rendering platform known as Reality Server made by Mental Images in Germany. These renderings are screenshots from the Reality Server rendered remotely over the internet. The procedural content was modeled in the City Engine software as displayed below. Footprints of the buildings were used to generate much more complex structures using CGA grammar rules created under the guidance of Roman archaeologists. The temples were also modeled procedurally. The Reality Server interface is authored in Flex and can be accessed using only a web browser and a Flash plugin. This allows the complex model to be rendered remotely on a server and then distributed securely over the internet. Viewers can interact with the model in this interface in a number of different ways. There are several jump points to landmarks of note like the Circus Maximus hard-coded into the interface. A number of camera navigation controls in three different views are also implemented. The viewer has free range to orbit, pan, zoom, adjust the field of view, as well as a number of other features. A walk Navigation also has been implemented to simulate the motion of walking through the model. The camera navigation modes allow for fine movements around areas of detail as well as larger gross movements using the orthographic views for larger shifts in view. A system of progressive rendering allows a complex lighting model to be rendered at interactive frame rates. Another useful feature implemented in this interface is the ability to render out an image at an arbitrary resolution. The image simply renders out in the browser window and is saved to the desktop. You can adjust the image quality as well as the resolution and select which view you'd like to render from. Another useful feature is the measuring tape. When the user selects any two points in the model in an orthographic view, the measuring tape displays the real-world distance between those points.